Since Ubuntu has started pushing snaps more and more, I don't know how much they are actually needed for the whole Ubuntu system to work. So if you are going to remove snaps, just be sure to have a backup. So first thing you want to maybe do is to install Flatpaks just so you have another space where you can install packages in case they are not included in Ubuntu repositories and you can do this with this command just add flatpak repository with this command and now you should get this icon for the software where you can install flatpaks if you go to software repositories you can see that flathub is enabled and now you can start uninstalling snaps First thing you want to do is just to stop the SnapD service. And if you look at the processes, you will see that something is still running. So what you do is just to kill those processes and you just take the number and then you stop the service again. It will have the same message, but as you can see, all the processes are dead. Now that everything is turned off, you can just uninstall everything that is installed via SNAPS and you can use this command you can see i had uh, firefox and thunderbird and some other packages and when that is done you can just remove the rest of the directories that snap left behind so one is in your home folder one is in the cache folder and one is in the root folder and when all that is deleted you can just check if some folder is left over so you can type in this command and you can delete this one as well. This one are in temp folders, so it doesn't matter because they will be gone after restart. So basically now you have removed snaps, but if you don't want them to appear again, you can create and edit this file. Use whatever editor you prefer. I will just use micro. And then you add these three lines. Links to all the comments and everything I have written here is in the description, of course. And then this should uh, disable if snaps were ever to be installed with some upgrade updates, at least in theory. Now you can save the file and quit. And after all that, you can just restart the computer. And when you restart and you check for snapd, you will see that no snapd daemon is running. And also the snap store is gone from uh, this menu. And all you are left with the flatpak store. And if you search for Firefox, for instance, you can see you can install it from flathub only. And that's all.